was the best defensive player, and we gifted him a hat. <laughs> Rex, I should say Where we did gifted you get him the a hat. Cowboy hat. Um, places unknown. Oh, okay. Yeah, I do not want to divulge my sources. The last time <laughs> I told people where I got a hat, Oofmatic got one that was just like mine. <laughs> All right, I, I'm, I'm done All right, with that enough. whole game. That that no. Find your own hats. <laughs> All right, we're on Pat's stage. All right, yeah, we are. Yeah, this is really good for Patroclus. Yeah. Because there's three walls he can pop you over with the CE. Yeah. And, and some characters will either have trouble with the low, with the low stiff wall or the breakable high wall behind him. Yeah. And uh, it's also good to note that uh, Ezio has four ring out games in comparison. Mm. Yeah, most definitely. Like that half wall is a threat if he has a critical edge. There you go. Oh, definitely. Yeah, the half wall is that you see in the left. Is definitely where Ezio is going to struggle, but he's going to be good on the open edge and the breakable wall. Like he can kick you through a breakable yeah, wall. Yeah, he's going to try to like, corner pressure him more than uh, go for wall spots. Yeah. Oh, the stop! Yeah. Ooh. Right, poking it out. Oh, his jump kick went. Yeah, yeah, he should have done the up forward jump kick, not the neutral jump kick. Oh, no hit confirmed. No hit, yeah. Jim's backing off. Ooh. Nice punish. That's yeah. ideal. Yeah, Jimbo known for being on point with his punishes. Which is kind of has to be the marquee of a defensive player. And uh, he just tried to punish the throw, but uh, it's kind of tricky against Petrovla since his throws recover faster than the rest of the cast. Yeah, that's going to happen. Man. Well, that's not safe. Oh, oh, out of range. Out of range for the punch. <laughs> Apparently, great minds take alike. Oh. Nice oh, movement. Oh, wow, I tried no to YOLO CE. CE. No, Jimbo set up too tight for the YOLO CE. Throwing him. Yeah, man. Ooh. All right. God for the same stage. Indeed. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. Yeah, that's, that's a smart choice from Drake. Silence. Yeah, most definitely. Unless you want to, like, an infinite stage. Even then, like, this stage is great. Yeah. Alright. Looks like Drake's uh, playing a little pussy here. Yeah. And there's. Oh, man. the lag low. <laughs> yeah, he got mileage out of that one against. <laughs> yeah. It's White Fox. That was hilarious. Like, man. It's just a little you don't see very often. Ooh. Yeah, because everyone blocks it. Wow, he stepped that. Mm. Oh. Arrow to the face. Yeah, that's one of the special things about SEO, so he can whip punish you from any range. Yeah. Oh, most definitely. Not quite as hard as an Oprah, but yeah. it's not something to laugh at either. It's a very important part of his kit. It's a counter hit. Yeah. Yeah, that's a really important oh, part big of it. Yeah, really. Yeah, like I was saying, the, the full screen punish for Ezio is really important because overall his range is kind of poor. But because of having a full screen punish like a crossbow, he can maintain spacing against most of the cast. Yeah, exactly. And do well with it. So it really gives him the freedom to play more defensive at range or up close, and there's a lot of different ways you can play Ezio. Yeah, and it's also nice that Sigby Ravage, when he uh, gets a successful punish, he's going to be full screen away from the opponent. Yeah, and it, it gives him a knockdown where he can close the gap and stuff someone for trying to push buttons. Like right there. Or, yeah, just take a whole bunch of damage and win around. Now, yeah, Drake has all of the meters. Big whip. That missed for some reason. Ooh, and yeah. That. I like that T. That's going to set him up for a ring out mix up if he can get some kind of launch going on. Or any kind of combo, really. Very nice. Oh, move and there it is. I Man, I have to wonder if he could have gotten that done with less meter. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's hard to say at that point. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I don't, I don't think a 236B would have done it. Maybe a 236B trade right? Maybe. But I think that might scale the guts. So maybe that really was what he had to do to kill him. Yeah. And Pat raised so much meter that uh, it's yeah. not that big of a deal if he uh, drains it all. 
Definitely. Didn't tackle. Yeah, I know. Drake needs to come up big. Jim chilling out. Oh, the stomp! Very nice. Let's see. Uh, All right. JTD up 2 0. Same stage, though. Catching him. Very nice jump. Jim's just in this there right now. He can't Man. seem to find any momentum here. He gets the perfect. Whew. Yeah, yeah. Jim just guessed right at every like possible opportunity yeah. in that round, and Very that's smart. what happens. All right, Drake's broken wow, the float. Just runs into it. Oh man, he is not respecting that punish. And the lag low. Very nice. Ooh. Face. One more hit. Oh, he's stuck. Okay. That's not good. He's going to be at the end, and now Drake's going to be able to threaten to kill. Nope. Jim's just uh, baiting stuff right now. Yeah, not what he was looking for. No. Oh, man. That was really close. Oh, man. Ooh, and then, it's, you know, he's not going to like for the C. I like that. It's not as good a damage as he can get out of that meter. And especially when you're behind, you need to be really careful how you use your meter. Nice Good just guard. Just guard. Bam. Oh, that's good. Man, stocked up a full two bars with that combo. And that. There you go. Spend it down. Good stuff. See there? I really like Drake's meter, man. Alright, now uh, Jim's the one with him. Man, uh, right there, Spence the weapon. Oh man! Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. It's not gonna be it though. Yeah, where to go? Oh, damn! <laughs> Very nice. Wow, that worked. So that was a 3-0. Jim's favorite. He's looking pretty strong. Yeah, it's yeah. The cowboy hat. JTD is looking phenomenal today.